Spicato doesn't work at the frog. Find a sweet point where bouncing feels natural and then start making the stroke broader. The higher the register, the more bow you need. On the lower register, we need a rather vertical motion and narrower stroke. The reason for this is the different mass of the strings. The thicker the string, the higher resistance we have to overcome. Jumping too high with the bow will suffocate the G string. On the other hand, using too much bow on the E string will make just noise. Playing spiccato with the bow doesn't mean your left hand has to play short. A well-connected left hand will add resonance to your spiccato, improving it with a singing quality. Make sure you don't make an accent on the last quarter staccato note. A legitimate interpretation is that every quarter note has to sound equally strong and short because all of them have a staccato sign. That's great if the conductor says so. Nevertheless, I would leave this thought aside when playing an audition. It's just a common practice. When playing Mozart, we don't make an accent on the last note. Care has to be taken when playing sforzandos on open strings, because they don't tolerate heavy accents.